pretty good way of starting the thing. Starting this Thank setup. you. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. A humble district attorney like myself is not used to such a ringing endorsement. And even one who cut Gotham's crime rate in half. Now, for too long, this city has burned with corruption and greed under Mayor Hill's authority. But I promise you, a vote for Harvey Dent is a vote to finally put your foot down. And together, we can stamp out the fire and save our great city. Most welcome. If only Mr. Wayne, my campaign's largest backer, could have heard that applause, he would sh Well, there he is. Fashionable and fashionably late, as always. Say hi, Bruce. Welcome well, to Wayne Manor. Wayne Manor, everyone. My apologies for the late arrival. Oh, not to worry, Mr. Wayne. We've all made ourselves very comfortable. Thank you. Thank you again, everyone, for your unwavering support. Together, we will change Gotham. Most of them. I like this guy. Mr. Wayne, thank you for opening your house to us. Now, I know this is the biggest mansion in Gotham, but I don't think you got lost on your way here. <laughs> Where were you? I know you prefer the brooding billionaire angle. So the sooner we make I like working on night shift, man. All right. Okay, don't get too alone. Don't get too He's great. Working the night shift. Yeah, well then you're pulling a double. No one came here tonight to see me. Some they want to see the Bruce Wayne, am I right? <laughs> and I can see him just fine from here. This shouldn't be painful. It's not a kidney stone. It's only a little face time with potential donors. Your face, specifically, with a mouth that's saying, Support Harvey Dent. We're the grease, they're the wheels. And they're rolling in enough cash I'll just my drink to for you. make Gotham <laughs> a place for families again. <laughs> <laughs> Courage before <laughs> adoring public. Kind of a cocky way. This will help you too, Not Bruce. To Once I've turned this city around as mayor, you'll be a hero for funding my campaign. Now all I need is a decent slogan. I'm terrible at those. It always makes me sound like a used car salesman. Put a dent in crime. How about uh, that's pretty good. I like it. Put I like it. In crime. Hmm? I like that you. a lot. It's not half bad. I'm gonna use that, Bruce. I meant what I said. Together, you and me, we change Gotham. A city free from crime, where children can play in the streets again. That's what I want too, Harvey, but you know how rough it is out there. We have to shake things up to make that happen. Well, we can start with a few hands, hmm? Come on. Hmm. Drunk? Was I drunk there? Oz. Mr. Wayne, I'd like to introduce you to Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course I know these two. Hello, Bruce. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises, and her husband voted for Mayor Hill last time. I'll admit it, Mr. Wayne. I don't know Mr. Dent from a pothole on Main Street, but I trust your family. If you believe in Dent, we believe in you. After all, Whoever you support is a reflection on you. Tonight's about Harvey, man. Well, I'm Let's flattered, calm down surely, a but bit. this night is about getting Harvey Dent elected so he can fix those potholes. <laughs> I think I speak for half the room when mm. I say politicians are puppets. Oh, come on now, Bob. I'm not a politician. I'm a crusader. Hmm? No strings attached. Old families like ours should flock together, you know, like birds. You're preaching, dear. No, it's true. The Waynes and Zellerbachs are reminders of the golden age of Gotham. Oh, this city's <laughs> luster faded years ago, Mr. Dent. Look at Gotham now. Murder in the streets, corruption in City Hall, that Cape Bat freak dealing out vigilante justice like it's the wild goddamn West. Oh, Bobby, regarding golden age, seems you're getting cranky in yours. There's always hope. Forgive me for being blunt, but... One man can't save this city. Yeah. And it's a dangerous mentality to yes, think depends so. on the man. I'd say it all depends on the man. Sometimes you need a person who will go off script. Such as dressing up in a bat costume? And taking out the criminals who ruin our city. Though the cape may be a bit much. <laughs> now, don't worry, hmm. though. I am not doing this alone. With Bruce's help, 
We're replacing the dangerously unsecure Arkham Asylum with a state-of-the-art mental health facility to help Gotham's most at-risk individuals. It will be dedicated to Thomas and Martha Wayne in the hopes that their fate will never be repeated. After all your parents did for this city, oh, to be killed in a botched robbery in some alleyway, it was terrible. Truly terrible. Yeah, a tragedy like that, it's such I'm surprised they haven't shown the scene yet. Must have Usually they show it at the very beginning of every film. only that film, so. deranged man had gotten the right treatment, maybe... I... Well, I don't like to think about maybes. And I'm sure you don't got it. Well, thank you. I wish my parents could be here speaking with you too. And thank you, Bruce, for investing in the health of this city's future. You have our support, Mr. Dent. Go get him. We're on our way. <laughs> Not saying I doubted you, but that went better than expected. <laughs> it is a night of ringing endorsements. Ooh, I like this too. Very oh, nice, oh, jazzy. Oh. Harvey Dent, Gotham's next mayor, and eager to know you. Vicky Vale, not interested, and reporter for the Gotham Gazette. This is a private fundraiser, Miss Vale. No reporters allowed. Well, you don't mind if I stay and ask a few questions, do you, Mr. Wayne? Well, you can ask me whatever you want at the press conference tomorrow. Mm. Actually, I'm here for Mr. Wayne. Well, he's I do actually. Time either. Actually, I do mind. If you're not on the list, you're not here. Sorry. <sighs> we'll talk tomorrow then. Mr. Wayne, you've you've got something on your collar. Um, <laughs> is that blood? Hmm. Yeah. I think no, I cut myself this, shaving. No, it's nothing. It just uh, cut myself shaving. What? Your butler didn't help you this time? Hey, kidding. Kidding. <laughs> Do excuse me, Master Bruce, but uh, another guest has arrived. I'm sure they'll find the bar. You may want to greet this one personally, sir. Carmine no. Falcone? Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Falcone's never been convicted of anything, except being a businessman who loves this city. Excuse us, Miss Vale. <laughs> and what kind of business do you think he's in? The one that controls enough votes to get me into City Hall. This is the necessary evil of politics, Bruce. It's in the service of a better Gotham, for all of us. At least hear him out before you kick him out. Oh, Jesus, look good. Harvey, inviting a known criminal to your fundraiser doesn't exactly look good for your squeaky clean image. Let me worry about that. A word of warning, Bruce. Play nice. <laughs> you know, I've been in the market for a new house. Decent walk-up, sky-high ceilings, plenty of room for my cars. I think I'll take it. Now I'll never say this to the decor offends my eyes. Oh, man, all flash, no class. My family built this house. It's not for sale. Oh. Everything's for sale, Mr. Wayne. And everyone. Just need to find the right currency. Come on, Falcone. Thank you for welcoming me into your home. Uh, they're all looking. I don't like this. You're a respectable man, right here. I'll refuse this one. Gentlemen, perhaps we'll all be more comfortable in the parlor. Follow me, if you will. All right. You should know, Mr. Falcone, my analysts say we're raising triple with Mayor Hill at... Hey, what's... Private audience. Oh, come on, guys. Bruce. You'll be fine out there, Harvey. Harvey comes with me, bro. Don't you dare be doing minutes. that shit. Harvey stays with us. The right. man's home is his castle. I respect that. Seen and not heard. Whatever you... I, I, what did I say?
Mr. District Attorney here wants to make sure the rules are followed. But in my experience, there's the law, and there's doing what's right. You understand? And I'd rather mm. see Harvey actually help this city instead of just saying he will. Well, I, I would say you can uphold the law and still do what's right. To a point. No one gets remembered for staying in the middle. Uh, Mr. Falcone, I... No more warnings. I ain't here to chinwag about politics, Mr. Wayne. Gives me indigestion. I got enough of that as is. So, let's talk relationship. Chalk this for me. Be a pal. I can get Harvey the mayor's seat. I'll leave it to the table for I you. Can pull it out from under him. Go fuck up. Whatever happened to being a gracious host? Okay, imagine yeah. this is me, and these are all my friends in Gotham. The businesses, restaurants, clubs, docks, unions, politicians. I make them all move. And I want to keep everything moving if Harvey gets elected. That's why I came here tonight to your lovely home. Hoping to make a new friend. One who can help Mr. Dent see the light. If need be. Between your businesses and mine, oh. I bet we employ half the city. Oh. Now we got Just a good thing going, so I don't see why we shouldn't get team along. up. Oh, get I'm along. everyone's friend. Which means you're really no one's. Pick a lane before you have a head-on collision. Ooh. You listen to me, kid. I know somewhere inside that tuxedo you understand this situation. Money gets money. The risks, the alliances, the hidden costs. Your father knew which hands to shake. And which to break. You're talking about my father that way. Don't you dare talk about my father. You're getting worked up over nothing. <laughs> Hell, I knew him longer than you did. People don't say no to me. Not for long. Master Bruce, your guests are leaving. I recommend seeing them out. You wouldn't want to be rude. Oh, yeah. Heed your butler's advice, kid. Oh, and I'm no longer interested in buying the house. The owner's a prick. And he's gonna get what's coming to him. We'll see about that. Batman! A Telltale series. That's actually a pretty long intro. <laughs> Season 2 of Walking Dead was not a very, did not have a very long intro. So this is actually kind of surprising. Well, what's that, buddy? You think that is, buddy? Thanks. Right. 